Greetings and welcome back to Chimo Chills. We are the Hungry Hussite Roman Empire to be. We are well on our way. If we jump onto this little screen right here, uh, restore the Roman Empire. It highlights, you can see it just highlights a little bit of purple everywhere where we need to conquer to restore Rome. If you notice, it's basically only France and the Middle East that is left. Let me do that again. See, we only have Iraq, a little bit of pockets there. We have Egypt. No, I don't even have to have all of Egypt. I just need their capital of Cairo. And then, of course, the uh, the greater France region, which we're on our way. We're on our way. We have maybe six more years of truce or was it eight years of truce with France. And we'll be back to at it with them. So Hussite Rome, here we come. Let's start today's episode. I'm going to actually use one of my subjects, Cassus Belli. To start off a war. France, opinion of Hungary, plus 30. Probably not going to take a yearly inflation reduction person, so it doesn't actually help me very much. Uh, I keep getting and losing this extra merchant. You could just, like, stay with me and that'd be okay. Just an idea. Just an idea, extra merchant. You could just stay and not come and go and, you know... Head to the north. Where are you going? You're going to get... You can't go any farther than that. And our navy is up here. Oh, yes. Of course, we have a... Uh, an army dropped off there. Which I'm tempted not to destroy. I want them to... Okay, so let's start this war. This is where... We're going to start a big war here. And everyone who is our neighbor again, we want to co -belligerent. So this, this drags Sweden in. We don't mind. That allows us to, to get Moscovy in there. Hello. Uh, do, do, do. So Lundberg is does have a border to me. And Halt does not. But whatever. We'll, we'll bring them in. Well, maybe we don't. We don't care about Saxony or Lutheringia. So Brabant. Lipe. All these guys. But Rick, you have a border with me? No. Well, let's get you in anyways. Oldenburg. Oldenburg definitely does, so I, I definitely want Oldenburg on that. Dortmund does not. I don't know if Dortmund brings in anyone I care about. Gosser does not. Friesland does, so we'll get Friesland co-belligerent. It costs me twice as much if I don't co-belligerent these... If I don't co-belligerent these countries in the peace deal, it costs me twice as much for everything. So that's why I'm, I'm just quickly looking at, like, oh, do I want to co-belligerent you? Brittany, yes, I do. I don't know that I would... Full annex then, but you never know. What is this, Württemberg? No, I don't think I care. So this is a pretty decent list. We have a hundred thousand coming in, uh, I'm, and I'm going to be able to to make a whole whack of one province miners just disappear. You no, know, uh, Württemberg would be the other way. Who'd get Regensburg and Sille? So Regensburg's a no, but Sille is a big yes, and Sille. Gets me Trent, and Trent is gets me Venice. Okay, I actually don't have a, a Cassus Belli on Venice, so that's fine. I'll drag them in, and we'll just smack them around. <laughs> and there's our opening war. We were at peace, and now the whole north of Europe is, is at war with me. What the heck, northern Europe? Not cool, man. Not cool. We have armies all in the wrong positions, so let's let's get them running back. Because, as you can see, my armies are all over the place, and they're all running back. I finished last episode, victor of a massive war, and I just started another war a, a month later. We... So, Venice did call the... answer the call? No, I don't I don't think Venice answered the, the call against me. Okay, so then if that's the case, I will make a claim on them. I'm hoping they don't. I don't really want them to. They, they might still, I'm really not sure, but... We get right on to Sille. Don't be silly. Get on to Sille. They'll both join up. Where are you going? You're going a nice roundabout route. So I have 33,000 in the north. 33 here. Doing nothing. So you can come up to Trent. Yeah, I, so I want this... this uh, court and country to fire so unrest at least one i think i need my provinces uh, occupied down to get that unrest up 
So it's, it's for that reason alone that I'm just kind of tempted to, to leave those rebels up there. Occupy all the land you want. I want that court and country to fire. I don't know what's the difference, silly. If you're on one province or the next, we're going to smash you when we get there. It will be smashy, smashy. We get to Brabant. And you might as well sit on their coastlines. None of these I really care about. Harsh treatment costs, sure. This is acceptable. You can run all the way up north to Poland. You have a leader? Yes, you do. How did Sweden get down into Burgundy so fast? That seems rather quick. I want to make sure I can declare on everyone else as these truth timers pop up. Aragon, I don't think I'll be able to because they're allied with France. And I don't... I, I need to have uh, France co-belligerent when I, when I fight them. So I need to take the French lands. That is a very high priority. I want to take massive chunks of French land. every oh, Max war score against France every single time is what I want. Uh, whom does nothing? You do nothing? Will we have any Egyptian rebels? Let's take a look at the unrest. Uh, maybe down here we'll have some rebellion. We'll do what we can to lessen that. And Syria is going to happen. So I'm just going to take half of the army north. And the other half. Let's grow a bit. 16? Yeah, it's a, a nice little army. A nice little imperial, imperial army to remain in Cairo. Do, 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 do. Claims on Egypt. Claims on Florence. Ooh, what do we like most? I guess Ravana. Ravina? Ravana? Ravina, Ravana. What a wonderful phrase. Okay, did you get stuck? No, you're still moving. This 20,000 is being reinforced. Oh, that's the reinforced tag, uh, uh, symbol. I didn't actually realize that. There you go. I was this many years old when I learned that. We'll come up to the next. Bergens. Now, Trent, I want to start knocking these countries off ASAP. It's only eight aggressive expansion. I, I like that very much. Burita, come back down. Knock them off Picardy and on to Breton. Because Breton should have answered the call. Yes, they did. Uh, so I still don't have unrest more than one. Well, I'm gonna let them occupy anything they can of my land. Like I don't, I don't mind that. I'm not gonna try to take them off. Ooh, oh no, 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 no. <laughs> I'm just talking about wanting to let them occupy me. Oh, that's a little annoying. I don't think I'm going to be able to run away fast enough. No, <laughs> I just wiped that army too fast. Too fast. We're too good at what we do. Trent, man. You got to want peace. No? Levant? Levant. Well, I can't take your, your, um, your land anyway, so... We'll just take you out of any any truces or uh, coalitions or anything. Oh, here's a close battle. Wow, look at that. They had the numbers advantage. Yeah, they, they, they piled up everyone they had. Well done, Hungarian warriors. Well done. You lost, but no no, that was a that that was a, a close loss, not a a shellacking. You didn't get pummeled, you didn't get sent embarrassed fleeing away. You held your heads high. This army, once it gets to Greece, I'm going to grow. And you might as well head up there too. I only need the one army down here. You've already been inflated in size. Alright, Sile, let's try this again. I have you occupied. I don't think... No, they, they have to have armies still. There's no way that they, they want to fight. Where I have them full. You know, full occupied. No army. No nothing. Why are you... Oh, you were the retreating army. Okay. Let's 
fine. We'll get up there on that fort. Come there, come over there and get them off of that fort. The capital of Calais must not fall. And Venice wants military access. You got it, Venice. You got it. I was supposed to be at war with you, Venice. You're, you're kind of lucky that I am not. So, Siena full annexed Florence down there. And I want to get a claim on Genoa. I should have actually left a bunch more of those countries as not Hussite. I was just <clears throat> going over the top. I was just going over the top to make sure that no countries could become the, the emperor. That's what I was doing there. So, do and 18 is a nice magic number. Hear good things about it. You can come down there with them. One fort, two fort, back. No. So one fort, two fort, and to Stetton. On to that fort. I don't think they have large enough stacks where I need to worry about 20,000 of my troops. I, I could be wrong, but I, I'm, I'm feeling okay that if, if I have 20,000, they uh, they won't be able to just spank me away. I'll, I'll, I'll be able to hold them out. So it is December. It would be nice to grab a peace treaty, if I could. We're going to ask again. We'll start with Brigens. Brigens is a no. Oh, they, they, they have to have their army. All right. There's, there will be no peace. So be it. There will be no peace. The war will continue. So that's Regensburg. Two mines. Your pronunciation of countries gets really good, or provinces and places gets really good playing a place like this. Because you, you say a place so many times, and sooner or later you're like, I want to know how to say that. So, you, so you, you hear someone else say it, and you pay attention. You're like, <laughs> then, of course, if they're saying it wrong, they're just teaching you to say it wrong. Which, what are you going to do, right? Alright, we have Rebellion popping off there. You're heading over, and... You should really be standing in the Syrian land, because we know that's where the rebellion's going to occur. How will this war go? Let's get our stacked leader on there. Haha, <laughs> much better. Come on, reinforce, go for it, do it, reinforce. Oh, stack on the Swedish army. Feels bad for the enemies. Feels bad for the enemy. And we'll just do a little sweeping movement and smack some more out of the way. I don't know how I, how I don't have unrest at one. It seems like I really should. Up onto that fort. Reinforcing. Don't worry, Genoa. I haven't forgot about you. My truce is up with you, and I am making claims on you as we speak. Another wipe. Yes, that's what we're talking about. That is lights out there. Lights out for the, the Swedes. And the Swedes were the largest, the largest part of that, uh, the war by far for them. Hungary adds five, 75 spy network on the mighty Ulm. Ulm is two provinces. Well, we will happily take uh, claims on Ulm. I wonder if I can declare on Ulm. Doesn't look like I have a, a peace treaty actually. And Regenberg won't join. And you're just two provinces that I want, so. We are definitely declaring on Ulm. Let's get our Venice diplomat back. Declare. And send him back over to... Ooh, actually, I intended to declare one more war here in the north. Again, this is this is for Polish cor uh, claims. And because no one will join against me, that's why I want to fire it now. What is going on here? And there you go. So three wars is far better. It, it's it's not a big increase of, of red on the map. National sovereignty with our next idea group. Now I want to go trade because it'll make me so much money. It just it will. It'll make me incredible amounts of ducats. I'll be able to upgrade everything. But I want my diplomat my diplomatic power too. So I'm I'm a little split. I could go economic. Could always go quality. It could always go defensive. It goes with uh, the the admin admin uh, the admin ideas are pretty good. 
Um, we're gonna go trade. So be it. It'll be a long time before I can fill out that that idea group, especially because I am converting provinces culture, uh, as I showed in the the last episode. There, I've been pretty active at doing so. Let's take a little quick boo at that. As you see, Hungarian doesn't naturally exist over here. <laughs> and the, what is it? The Caspian Sea and down here in North Africa. It doesn't... Uh, what would that be? Carthage? It doesn't normally exist down there. So we've been very aggressively expanding our our cultural borders. Because our whatever your primary culture is, when you switch to Rome, they all become Roman. So that's why I'm doing that. Doing that now. And for the memes. It's nice when I, once I culture... Once I switch over to Rome, that... Okay, we're going to get half this army coming here. I'm going to send the other half towards QQ. And I am going to kick off war with QQ. Why? I, I don't know. Why not? Right? Why not, I say. We'll finish sieging down Brittany. And who's next? Up to Frankfurt. It'll be Niederheisen. Niederheisen? Niederhosen? Niederheisen? I don't know if those words have anything to do with one another. <laughs> Alright, Pomerania. Let's move in on you. This army's big enough. It's close enough to 20,000 that I can, I can separate them up. This can happen. This army can also be separated. You don't need to be quite so big over there, big guy, okay? Well, easy there, big guy. Big fella. We accept, we accept, we accept. Go on to there. Fort, province, and whom else does nothing? It's my buddy on the QQ border. Let's go straight south and get them out of here. There's no need for them to be down here. I could also use a Fort. None of these are mountains. Ah, Dauphine would be a really nice fort location, but this will do. Just a level two. Just something to slow them down so they can't instantly take it next time, you know? Oh, randomly ran into an army. Sure. A little wipe. Accidental wipes are satisfying as purposeful wipes. Accidental wipes are actually far more satisfying than the accidental variant. Okay, so our armies are on the borders. Navy, you gotta come home. We have some Cretan separatists. They are upset with us in Crete for whatever reason. I don't get it. I don't speak Cretan, so I don't, I don't, I'm not able to help you on why they're upset. But they are upset nonetheless. How about Silly? Silly, you, you, you ready to go? Silly is ready to go. Silly has seen the silliness of their ways. Finally, we have got Silly. You know what? Silly was on the possibility to be taken in the first or second episode. I almost took Silly, but here we are, um, 29 episodes later. Silly has finally fallen as, as she always should have. QQ, we're going into the Holy War. Most of this I am just going to feed to... Syria. I don't... Wow, I would like to co-belligerent Mushasha, but I don't want Bahamas in, so we're not going to. We're just going to do a Holy War. Like that. You'll come into that fort. You'll come on that fort. And you are awaiting your, your ride. Seems like this army can just run all the way over. They're not needed. The, the wars in the north are not so close that, that I have to have all of the stacks there. You can return home, brother. Return home. Alright, we have enough to start pouring you up. Oh, taking that idea group may not have been a, the, the best idea ever. I need to core... Oh, we got the coalition growing. I'm going to need to core provinces pretty, pretty regularly here. We will take the money. Well, the thing I can do about that is to upgrade my half-cost national unrest guy. Let's go with that guy. Let's let's upgrade him to a level 4. Maybe even a level 5. There you go. 15 and 15 monthly generation. Mana generation. That feels good. And we're ahead on the military tech. So, or not ahead, but we're, we're caught up 
on the military tech. We have such numbers that it's inconsequential. It doesn't even matter. We get to Dortmund. Yes, we can. No? We're just all locked in. How about Lipe? Le not even Mighty Lipe we can run to. All right, Trent, you are one province miner that won't go away either. You just won't go away. So we are absorbing Naples. Am I going to release any other vassals? Or do I save that Diplo slot for... I, I think I'm safe to take Brittany here. I really do. Take them on as a vassal. 49% war score. I can feed them just, just these border provinces. It, it's a little less to core up for myself. And you have a claim. You already have a, a, a core on Anju. So, yeah, we do it. Brittany is our latest vassal. Welcome into the club, Brittany. Welcome to the cup. We are two nations, one cup. So I can't enforce the religion on you. Or you're already Hussite. Okay, we just need to convert you. That's the case. Not a problem. That's something. Conversion, converting our vassals is something we can do very, very well. We love to do it. That saves us a lot of the uh, the core because we we didn't have the the we don't have the mana generation to core up all of Brittany at the moment and now that we don't have to core literally any Brittany makes a big difference. Uh, Regensburg they took Regensburg back. All right, let's go north to Regensburg then. And everyone else can move over to Nice. You are coming to grab them at the moment. You are on... You got stuck before the fort, as you do. But you you did not. Nuremberg, join your coalition all you like, man. It's not gonna... It's not gonna help you. Though it might make a really good episode if we get a nice, fat coalition to, to form up and actually attack me. Attack me at, like, a vulnerable time. Where I'm, where I'm like, okay, look, let's have fun and count how many wars I can create. And then the coalition attacks me at that moment. That's not gonna happen. Well, mm, I would attack the coalition. So it's not that that couldn't happen, but you know what I'm saying. Uh, alliance with our enemy of Frankfurt. No, I don't like that. So, and then there's always the option to just attack this coalition right now. See, it's only 56,000 manpower. It's not a massive, massive coalition. I could call in the Lobodian order. I could even call in the Beck. <laughs> it calls Brigands back in. Why didn't I... Why didn't I... Oh, they won't join because I'm already at war with them. Okay. You know what? We are going to do that. We don't have enough war going on. <laughs> we don't have enough war going on. We're we are going to up this. Up this ante. And I'm definitely going to have to keep this... The My armies that are in the... Uh, in the West right now. They're going to have to stay in the West. They cannot... You cannot come home. You're not getting any time off this year, guys. Sorry, gentlemen. My apologies. So you come out to see, deal with these Cretan rebels. You're still on your sieges. Then you'll come over there, defend Syria. Okay, I've been a little silly on my attacking wars here. Let's make a quick peek. No. Morocco in 48. So Morocco would really be the only one there that I think I would just declare on regardless of the situation. Genoa, here we come. And that is, what, Saluzo, or what is that place? Queno. Queno? Queno. Queno, here we come. Five wars. I think this may be the first time I've had five wars going at the same time. Oh, I don't care about Bornholm. Bornholm's a tiny little island that I stole from Denmark. I am okay with uh, the, those, those negatives. Trent, where is your army hiding? Finally, finally I found their army wherever they were, and I, uh, I made them go bye-bye. That's another one province miner gone. So our overextension isn't the issue at all here. It is it's completely just not having the, the mana points to, uh, to core everything up. Now in the north here, I'm not going to take any of this land for myself. All of that's going to Poland. Let's get down there for the fleet. Hmm, is this 21,000? 
Gosler. And you up to the mighty Lipe. Grab that army. They won't be able to boat bomb because they're not on the coast, but pretty close. They'll, they'll come right next to them. And we will run that way right away. Let's go north and then south onto Nuremberg. Who is offering me peace? Wurttemberg. No, you're a one province miner. Yeah, you know what? I will. No, I'll just max out. Oh, I can't, can't even max. What? I can't even max out the war score. I don't even have you occupied, that's why. Well then no, I don't want peace with you. I want at least your money, dude. Come on. Haven't you been paying attention this whole game? What I've been doing to like the world? Roma. I'm role playing as Roma. This is what Roma does. Alright, we got there in time. We have a decent general, so we're not gonna wait. We don't have to reform the front lines. There was no no mass loss on the way over. Who is this? Is there enough? No, there's not enough in the area to really... Oh, and I have my stack general on there, too. That's a 5-6-3-3 five, five, three, three general. Yeah, I'll, I'll take whatever they'll throw at me. Come on, stack up, stack up. No, I got the white. Is that two whites from the same battle? How did that happen? That was like two instant whites. Or or, or I just completely miss, miss saw that, misread that. I do want you to lock... They're not going to lock, so I'm going to have to just run to them, it looks like. Or just siege down that capital. Nuremberg's got to fall. So Pomerania, we've got largely sieged down. You are just... that. Those provinces there? Ah, that's fine. We'll let that continue. I'm going to just improve relations with Brittany. We'll, we'll, we'll allow this war to continue. At its current pace. Obviously going our way. We're winning, but it's a little hectic. There's a lot going on, and there's a lot of uh, enemy tags all over the map. So I gotta just be constantly paying attention here. Alright, we got that wipe, so let's go on to... Oh, you ran south, did you? So I'll... Transport the army as fast as I can get them to Gaza, and then run them over. Nothing. 24. Can you get on the fort? Yes, you can. Perfect. Ooh, that's a 27,000. I, I don't think they're going to attack me. I still have massive morale bonuses over everyone. <laughs> He's totally running away. Get out of here, QQ. Get out of here. Uh, so it's Mushasha. We'll run over to Mushasha, see what they have to say. Maybe they have some interesting things to tell me. Split. As many forts as possible seen, being sieged down is for the best. This navy does nothing here. Let's go sit on the, the Genoa coastline. Oh, we'll have a, a real battle. They got heavies and everything. It will be a real battle. Not just me spanking some, some random navy out of the way. Out of the way, a random navy. Uh, unfortunately, I did not get my claims on Genoa before the war started. So can come home. Mm -hmm. So this will, this will allow me to take whatever the heck I want from uh, from Pomerania. I don't have to go all out on them, but I would like to the two forts take all their land, just put them out to the sea. They don't seem to mind it. They're, they're almost they're almost keen for it. I'm pretty sure this list is actually getting smaller. That that knocking off these one province miners is paying off. Oh, I didn't mean to take that for myself. Well, that's okay. That can be the that can be the natural border. That can be the natural border. That will take everything west of there for for the Roman Empire. Not that Poland can't be uh, administrated in at some future date. I'm sure the Poles would love to be part of our empire. Well, they are. The Poles, the Poles have been with been with us since like episode six or seven. They are, they are like this with us. Right, 
just sitting there getting attrition. Did they take Regensburg back again? How many times are you going to unsiege that place? Well, we'll go right back to it. I'm okay with it. As long as you're you're playing, you know, these games with me, you're not you're not taking crucial places. <laughs> what are we for force limit? Should we build another army? Okay, where are we here? Let's go into the army. Let's create a template. Ten, two, and eight, or twenty, two, and twelve. I like it. And we'll just have that as a standard army. If I need to, if I need to grab a random army quick, that's that's my, uh, and I can enhance it from there. Right, so you're going back up to that fort. Get on to to Crete is a fort. Did I just run by a fort on the way in? No. Whatever. We'll go up to another fort up there. I like how they're sieging down Brittany with such zeal. They're like, we gotta get Brittany. Brittany isn't it's so important to the to the Hungarian war effort. It's like, dude, I just picked up Brittany. I don't even we haven't even set up an embassy yet. But sure. They are crucial to the effort. So crucial. Definitely need another fort over here. This is uh, exposing my lack of forts in that area. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Saxony joining a coalition against me. Why would they do that? The coalition grew that big already. Huh. I like it. It's bigger than the army. It's bigger than the coalition I'm already at war with. So you're going to fort. You're going up that way. Is that Russia? Russia spanking on Sweden up there? Very good. Could be time to no only thirty eight percent war score that is not nearly enough. The dish Martian invading the English, the British Isles. Good on you. Still don't have that uh, disaster fire for whatever reason. So I will I will start getting those provinces back. I don't need to lose that too. I don't need a tag to pop up in my line. That's for sure. Up to Navarra. One wipe that twenty-seven army. I just, yeah, let's let's see. Oh, we can't get it. We'll get out of the way in time. I would have taken that battle. I would have taken that battle for sure. Aragon in a coalition against me. I'm okay with that again. It is it was France. I'm I'm really worried about. I have a feeling this coalition is going to just disappear anyways. Once this war, once these series of wars are up, that they're going to be like, ah, uh, maybe we don't want to fight this guy. Well, they took the siege, but we also caught them, just just as they took it. So let's get over here to Prague and back to whatever that place is, Bamberg. Bamberg. I love that. I love that place's name, Bamberg. Okay, so that was the army that took the siege, got rid of them, revenge for the fallen, and yeah, we do a little bit of carpet sieging out. That army will head... I need to build another template? It seems that the the um, the economy can handle it. So let's do it. Let's build another army, and they will go deal with these people flooding into the main area. We, we don't want that. That should fall fairly fast. Oh, we did win that battle. Look at that. I, I kind of expected them to pile up on me, use their numbers in the area, and just pile, keep piling up on me, and then make me no more. Thank you for not doing that. I'm not going to turn around and, and go help Brittany at all. Like I, I don't care about you, Brittany. You're fine. No, I can't get that way. What fort is blocking me? Is it something down here? I don't, I don't really know what's blocking me. Little little zone of control wackiness. It happens. Brigands, are you part of a coalition? No, you're not. All right, there you go. There's another one province miner. No longer a thorn in our side. Do you have any other bordering provinces? Okay, so you're going to go to Poland. You're going to Poland. 
you are going to Poland. I think this is whom I declared. Yeah, I declared on Stettin. So they will be the very last um, country that I piece out from that war. And as you can see, it's a pretty big, pretty big list. Oldenburg? This is Oldenburg. Okay, so I have provinces next to Oldenburg. Let's see what they would be looking at giving me. I, I definitely want your coastline. What if I just took their coast? I think that's a good start. Yeah, we'll do that. And some money, and throw you out. And goodbye, Oldenburg. Happily pour up a 54 dev. We took a 54 dev province from him there. Oh, I did not realize. I'm not even peeking at the aggressive expansion. I'm not even glancing at it. I have no idea how, how mad it's making them. It just, it is making them very mad. Let's, let's be clear on that. So is this 22,000 form? No. You're still waiting on your cannons. Oh, Vienna fell. Feels bad. Vienna fell. Losses are occurring. We're not, we're not just running forward. Losses are occurring as well. The Dish Martians are on England. I repeat, the Dish Martians are on England. They're not going to be able to siege down London, so they're just going to be a slight annoyance up there, but they will do that. There will be an annoyance. Uh, and Zag, that's another fort. I didn't get either of these armies, armies put together in time. So what is it, a 34,000 stack is what I'm, what I'm making here? Looks like it. Lipe, I got no borders with you, friend. I, if I got no borders, I got no beef, so see ya. Damascus, taken back. Where are you going here? And then change that plan up. Keep on sieging. Ganja. Alright, 34. Is that fully stacked army? Yes, it is. You can come north to that fort. And, oh, are they going to the capital? Get away from my capital. We are going to run back to Pesh to help. That is my super general that I am running back. Matias is a absolute Chad stud. He has to go save the day. And come south. North again. You are being built up. You are singles. What are you doing? 20. 27, you're, you're way too way too needed to be standing around doing nothing. We, we kind of need you everywhere. How don't I have unrest of one at this point? Where they're sieging down my, my land and everything. Is it war exhaustion? What is it exactly? Unrest at least one. I'm over one war exhaustion. Hmm. Clearly I do not understand that one mechanic very well. I, I thought it was simply I just have to have my land occupied up. Or, or again, maybe I just don't have enough land occupied up. That could be it. I just I just need more still, that's all. I'm just thinking out loud. I'm not sure. Alright, you're still forming up. Mm -hmm, they're sieging hard. Sieging hard in, in my northeast lands. Yeah. Gotta get some big, big forts up there. Can't have that happening every time I'm fighting in the east. Especially when I have the money to afford it, right? Like it's not that it's not that I can't afford it. So don't stop. No, you're not stopping before that fort. We'll get down there. Come south to your next siege. And west. Why not? Because of this fort here? Alright, fine, go help there instead. And Halt offers me peace. Nuremberg has borders with me. Where's Anne Holt? Uh, we'll, we'll let them offer again. I'm in no rush. That's Rebels taken care of down there. They took Regensburg back again! <laughs> I've lost track how many times that's been. That has been a, a, a meme-worthy amount of times where they have just lifted that siege on Regensburg. They do not want to let Regensburg go. Well done. Well done, brave souls. Coalition keeps growing. I don't care. France is all I care about. 
No, Morocco. Correction. Morocco in August. Ooh, okay. So Morocco will be my, my next declare. I have no one in the region. Literally not a soul. We must protect our trade. Oh, it's my five statesman guy who just died. That feels bad. So what do you... You need to be a culture that's accepted. So that's Swiss. Obviously, it's not accepted. Now, there's no other diplomatic people. All right, we'll go a, a level three spy then. So be it. And can we upgrade you? We can't upgrade you. You're not the right culture group. Feels bad. Uh, like I said, the Dish Martians are sieging down London, but they don't even have enough people to do so. So it's it's let's say not very effective at best. I'm gonna come north and help out my new army, my newest army. Mm -hmm. Old Mark. I can just basically assume every province that I don't have occupied next to me is, is enemy. Oh no, 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 I was assuming too quick there. Not all of them. There are some that I'm at peace with. Magdenburg, we can assume that. Uh, Nuremberg actually would be a smarter choice, I'm thinking. I'm gonna come down to Nuremberg instead. I got enough enough armies carpet sieging in the north. And oh, did I just miss that? I just missed that. Oh, I don't like that. I totally just. That's annoying. That is annoying. All right, Mechel Mecklenburg. I don't know. Do I even have you? Co-belligerent Mecklenburg. Oh, that's annoying. I'm really annoyed by that. I I, I wanted to get that war declared. <laughs> Alright, let's peace out. Take the money. Move on. On to the next order of business. Lundberg, maybe? And you could be Lubeck. Yeah. Oh, I picked the wrong one there. I didn't want to go down to zero. Zero stab. We'll bring ourselves back up to one. You're coming to Bamberg. You're taking that siege back, and you are going north, as far north as you can. Friesland falls. So let's time that. Let's get a good leader on here. Good enough. Let him lock in, and then we will charge south. Friesland. What have we made you not exist? You're not a one province miner. See, I'm sure that this list is getting smaller just because I keep making the uh, the countries disappear. But I want him off, and there we go. More of the northern coastline has, is going to be reintegrated into Roman lands. Ooh, that was a nice little naval wipe. So the hope will be, once I start piecing out from all this, that, that the, the coalition breaks up. And if it doesn't, I just have to attack it in its, in its entirety. It's not the end of the world, it's just not how I wanted to do it. Now as for QQ, it might make sense for me just to take this all in one big peace, peace deal and have all of those countries have that, that long truce timer. Mm -hmm. And halt. Halts and halts. We do have a border province with you. All right, we'll take that just that one border province. We'll keep pe creeping forward. And some money. And out you go. We don't have the... The mana points to, to start corny up yet. This is okay. We want to get ourselves up to that 90% overextension limit. Because that means we are maximizing what we can take. To the next fort. Oh no, Vienna would be a more important fort for sure. And you are all in forts. You're doing nothing. Oh, that's, that still feels bad. I, I I was literally getting that army ready to run south and, and to go say hi. Now that can't happen. Uh, so Genoa is co belligerent? Um, where are you, Genoa? 
No, you're part of a coalition, unfortunately. So it's only these guys who I can like, like Loonberg. I would like to, to throw out some of these countries. Not enough war score. We will have this fort no, in literally any moment. It could be one of these. It was not, but it could have been. Could have been. More forts fall. We catch another rebel, out, uh, another army out and about. And Syria becomes Hussite. Look at that. We might just have to do a cut at some point here. I was thinking I would have one or more of these wars um, more wound down than this. Like, sorry, not one or more. I was thinking I would be down to maybe one or two wars max at this point. I didn't. I didn't realize I was going to keep declaring and that the coalition was going to grow. And yeah, I'd... let's let's start let's start getting a bit of peace. Lundberg. We are happy with what you'll give us. Out you go. Let's get the lands, Corrin. It's it's the mana generation holding us back. Oh well, we'll have nice long truce timers like literally everywhere. It's okay. We, we won't be at an imminent threat of being attacked, that's for sure. We haven't had the war goal against Riga pretty much this whole time. Let's go north and get this war goal. Stop being silly and, and go get it. Oh, right when, I, right when I'm heading around the mountains. Okay, fine. I'll get up there on the next fort. Mm. Not worry about Mushasha. Missionary? No. We don't have control over the province? What's going on? Why do we not? Let us go get control over this province. Both the, that, that stalls both the missionary and the, the coring. And we want to core all this up. ASAP. Right, down to Gallery. To Stad. Split. Go out. More. Up to the war goal, finally. What is going on here? Alina Carnano Pascopia. Yeah, like I'm gonna read all this. Um, a cheaper national unrest or yearly. I'll go with the cheaper national unrest. I don't even know that I'm going to get the chance to use her, but if I can, I will. Cheaper unrest is a okay in my books, especially when you can upgrade them. That's where you, you make them a level five, and then ba bam, pays off big time. I'll deal with the, the global trade loss. Why is this army so small? Did I just inherit this army? Or are they that weak? No, they're just a random army. Oh, what am I thinking? I, I did a split. I split my, my intact army. Okay. Pay attention, Dave. It helps. It helps a lot. On to the next fort. You are fine. Okay, Regensburg, finally. We're not going to go back and forth with you any longer. We're going to just have peace in our time. You don't need allies. Why would you need allies? It's not like you have a big, aggressive neighbor anywhere around you. Come on. What need would you have for allies? All right, so we're on both those forts. Oh, the rebels will have to be dealt with. We'll come back here, deal with the rebels back in Syria. Or more of the coring you yet? Are we converting you? Not particularly worried about all that. Oh, we're coring over this way? Culture converting over this way. Then what the heck were we we coring and, and, and what were we stuck on here? I'm not even sure now. Well, all the same. If I just go and, and go forward and, and win the wars, it won't matter, right? Go, go forth and take everything, and then, and then we'll, we'll be okay. Mm -hmm, that should be the capital of Mushasha. I don't... You know what? I just want to break this 
treaty. I don't want him to be friends with Bauman. Uh, I don't really care. QQ's not that big of a deal for me either. Do I take Basra? Yeah, let's let's let, let let us allow that war to continue just a bit more, so I can take a bit more war score on that. I don't have quite enough for what I want. I'm just gonna take the one province. I think I'll take Basra. It is a center of trade. It'll, it'll help with the flow of ducats to the homeland. We need control. Where is this Hanover? Okay, well let's go. Let's go get Hanover back in control. Ninety-nine percent on QQ. All right, so this will be how we will end this episode. We are going to take lots from the QQ. Uh, Kurdish, sure. You can take all of that. So we give you all this. And then we, what kind of claims do we have? Any? We have no claims. So then we would just take Borderland in the north. 100%. Most of it would go to uh, my vassal Syria. And sure, at some points we don't have. Uh, this will all be remaining with us, I believe. Yes. Yes. And still only those two we can't core. And this is as good a place as any to place a cut. Thank you very much for making it to the end. The the growth into Iraq is finally occurring. Syria is growing nice and big for us. We are attacking coalitions. There's, there's another one formed. Let's take a look. As you can see, there's another one formed. This doesn't do a great job at showing the current coalition. But if I... Uh, I don't know how to just to pull out who's actively in a coalition and who I'm fighting at. But basically all of Europe hates me. I don't get it. Next time we'll have to resolve this. We'll have to work it out with them. Come back, like, comment, all that great stuff. Have a great day. Goodbye.